Tim Conway, star of McHale's Navy and The Carol Burnett Show, has died. He was 85. The actor's rep told The Hollywood Reporter Conway died Tuesday at 8.45 a.m. at a healthcare facility in Los Angeles. According to recent reports, he was suffering from dementia and unable to speak after undergoing brain surgery in September. Starting back in October 1962, the actor provided a whole lot of heart and laughs on ABC's McHale's Navy for four seasons. Conway earned an Emmy nomination in 1963 for his work on the show. The sitcom was so popular, Universal Pictures parlayed the concept into two feature films, McHale's Navy in 1964, and McHale's Navy joins the Air Force in 1965. Conway was the focal point of both. But the comedian's popularity skyrocketed after he joined CBS's The Carol Burnett Show in 1975, after making numerous guest appearances on the program. He ended up being a regular on four of its 11 seasons. Conway's array of goofy characters combined with his impeccable comic timing helped make the show a classic. He won two Emmys and a Golden Globe for performing, and another Emmy for his writing on the series. Conway also acted in numerous movies and guest starred on countless television shows over the years. He added two Emmy statues to his trophy shelf for guest appearances on Coach and 30 Rock. In 1999, Conway even found a new generation of fans when he voiced the character of Barnacle Boy on SpongeBob SquarePants. They want to know how we became a crime-fighting duo. For much more on Tim Conway's life and career, go to THR.com. Until next time, for The Hollywood Reporter News, I'm Tiffany Taylor.